Hello and welcome to my fitness channel. So in my fitness channel I will be teaching you how to get hourglass shape and this is from years and years of um, workout and years and years of knowing which type of workouts give uh, a certain body type. So as you can see this is my shape and this is all natural and I realized it's uh, by doing certain type of exercises that I got this shape and I was very reluctant about doing this fitness channel or creating this fitness channel because um, usually people see it in a wrong way they kind of t tend to sexualize stuff and make people you know sorry about the phone <sighs> one moment just gonna Yeah, so people tend to like um, focus on you trying to show your body, but that's not my aim in this channel. So I'm kind of like very modest and showing my whole body has been a little bit, you know, but you know, if you want to do a fitness channel, you, you have to show the exercises. So this channel will be to get this hourglass shape since a lot of people ask me how I, how I do it. so much for watching Bye. okay hi everybody so this is my fitness workout routine for curves for a glass shape pear shape so this is the sweater that I'm wearing because I feel like um, yeah it's a little bit cold today that's why so I'm gonna put up my sweater so we're gonna start by stretching or just like stretching the neck so we don't get any injuries Something I learned from a Chinese lady and it actually works with your nerves so it's like an acupuncture one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty so we always start by working out the first part then we just mid stretch a little bit like this like this and then like this one two three four five and then one two three four five and then we want to have stronger arms for arm fat and all of that.
our arms and shoulder a little bit we shake them and then we do like this one two three So when you stretch on the side, you make sure that you touch your behind like you might think that this is too easy but you're actually stretching and opening up your nerves and muscles for blood flow so blood flow is a very important what people don't realize is that stretching also is not just for stretching the muscles but increases blood flow. So you want to have good blood flow. Then... Be careful when you do this part because you don't want to break this part. And then you just... You're supposed to um, feel it behind your lower legs. So you just do like that. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So now we want to take our dumbbells. And you can, if you don't have any dumbbells, so these are three kilograms each. You can use um, water bottles and you choose your weight. I feel like three kilos is enough for me, has always been enough for me. One was a little bit too small, too, too like um, light for me or, yeah. So three, you say light, but anyway. So you start by pushing these one, two, three. Okay, then you want to do this. 
it will look like. And one. Place these dumbbells now and first part is over in the second part we're gonna work more on the lower body okay everybody welcome to the second part and so I think I need to put down the camera a little bit one moment I should have edited off this off, but it's very unprofessional. But yeah, you understand. So we're gonna do the second part now. So we start with our dumbbells again. One, two, three. And please remember, you stretch before you begin. Yeah. So you you begin with the first part. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now you want to sit like this and you want to do 1, 2, 3, Just hang here 
and try to go a little bit lower and just Now you want to make sure you stretch your leg in between so you don't get any muscle pain. So yeah, now I call this the arabesque because it's from the ballet arabesque and basically you just put your leg up and you just remove these. So you just put your leg up and let's say your leg is about 45 degree angle here as you can see. So you just put your leg up and then you lift it a couple of times like this i'm gonna show you one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty you do the same thing with the other leg one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven 12, 13, 14, 15, 15, 18, 19, 20. Okay. You just plie. 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 Stretch on the other side. Stretch on the other side. So this is a quick, easy workout where you just get the benefits of the hardcore muscles. You build your muscles as well as increase blood flow to increase circulation. Just stay here. It's very important that you just don't go down very quickly because this is a very sensitive area. So you just stay here and stretch. Stretch. You can look sideways if you want to, you know. And then again. And then we come back to this part where you stretch your upper body as well as your lower legs. You're supposed to fill it here and on the buttocks a little bit. And then on the other side so today I
One thing is that you never touch the floor with this leg. Yeah. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20. You're supposed to feel this in the lower leg. We go back to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20. Now we have to stretch again. And we stretch by this one on the floor. Oh, and the other leg in front. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. You just stretch it like this. And then on the other one. And then I'll try to show you here how you do. You just um, cross your legs like this, and then you go under with your arms, and you just, or you can just hang like this. You cross your legs, and you cross your other leg. Now you can feel the blood flow. And then you put your leg forward with toes, po toes pointing up. And then you just, you know, squeeze everything. You just. One and then two. So now you're done. Um, so this is basically the hourglass shape workout and these are routines that I found work for me as you can see I have an hourglass shape and yeah I hope hopefully I will post, post more fitness for you um, on this channel which is a bit mixed about makeup and perfumes but I decided because I have so many questions all these years on how I get my hourglass shape I have no surgery by the way and sorry to show my whole body but yeah so thank you so much for watching take care